guys haven't seen this in a while. Yes, say hello. Say hello. Oh yeah, we do. Got a few, a few announcements. I know we've been gone for a while. Really don't have, well, kind of have an excuse. Not really have an excuse. I just have been out of it, to say the least. Um, and. Oh, really? Oh, you. <laughs> Tears is elated to tell you that she's having a boy. Mm. First of all, we need to first tell them that we're pregnant. Yes, we're pregnant with baby number three. Due um, December. And it's a little boy, so we are having a little boy. Mm -hmm. Saw Junior. Yeah. In the mix, man. Yeah, we're having a little boy, so. I'm into my second trimester now, so feeling better. Um, this pregnancy, yes, baby. It hurt. I'm sorry, boo. I'll kiss it. This pregnancy was really, really different. So the beginning of it was like rough, but now it's just pretty much indigestion. So yeah, that's kind of where we've been at. You can see the bump. Bum, bum, bum. You probably can't really, really see it. The camera may exaggerate it a little bit, but. So today we are going out, um, and did I bring my mask? That mask. Oh well, yeah, <laughs> it's been a while. COVID. Oh yeah, cause I don't even think the last time we vlogged COVID was even happening. Yeah. We might have to stop at a beauty store or something to get a mask, cause I don't. I forgot it in the other car. Um, but okay, so today we're going out. What are we going out to get some stuff for our little guy? Maybe the girls. She didn't forgot she had her daughters, man. As soon as we had, a, uh, we found out we having a son. Mm. They're all about the little girls. Yeah. So we are getting something to eat, and then we're gonna go to go somewhere to get maybe a few things just to get out of the house, and then this probably be a two-part vlog. Because um tomorrow, what Mackenzie? Hi, Is she's I, okay? Can I get a uh, number six, please? Tomorrow. Sorry. Sorry. I can't guys, get a number six, a please. Number six. Let me take this off. So it is packed in the mall. It is packed in here. Um, we just do a zoom. But um. We decided to come to Children's Place, but it is like, even a lot, well, it's not really, it's not that, that bad, but hopefully they even got something in here that we want. It's like 75% off. It's like 75% off. So, we'll see. Okay. Hey, Kizzy got her mask on. Look at you, big girl. <laughs> I think she's actually okay because I didn't think she would leave it on, but I think she's actually okay with leaving it on because she sees everybody else with their mask on, so it's not like she's like trying to take it off. But this mama is out of breath. Yeah, when this mask sucks. Huh? So when this mask sucks. I know, but it's crazy. Like this is just real life now. You wanna put it on? Go ahead. Try it now. But yeah, we probably don't be here for long, but we're just gonna look at a few places. This is the first time that I've come to um, this particular mall, so we'll see. We'll see. And not even all the stores are open back up yet, just a few of them, but we need to get out and wanted to get some stuff. Say hello. Hello. I mean, say hello. Hello. <laughs> All right, guys. I'm gonna take this. I can take it off for a second. But we were standing in Children's Place line, and that that sucker was not moving. So we were like, we we left. <laughs> so we are at. Um, we came to Carter, not Carter's, Macy's. But I forgot that Macy's has um, a, like a Carter section in it. So hey, girls, can I go over here? So we're in the little boy section right now. Of course, Mackenzie, my my prissy daughter. Ah, 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 no talking. Ah, ah. I, you see the bed? You like the bed? Yeah. 
Yeah. Of course, she picked out a dress. Show them your dress. <laughs> Ami, you want a dress? You got your dress? Oh, girl, don't be showing people your stuff. Come on. <laughs> come on. So, yeah, we just gonna come in here and look for some stuff. Come on, girls. Come around here because I want to be able to see you. Ami, come. I think they're just happy to be out the house and to see a different environment. <laughs> um, look at this girl. Ami. Doing what she does best. Destructo. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yes, my bro. What size are those? Three months. We need to, we need to start getting like some big size. Okay, so with the girls, before we found out what we were having, like I got, I literally went through all the girls' stuff and like I bagged up everything that Ami can't fit. And it was like two big bags. And I said, I'm gonna put them in the basement. And then if we find out we having a girl, we just gotta bring them back up. <laughs> but if it's a boy, we're gonna give them away. So we do need to find a place to give them away too. So if you guys know of any places in like the Atlanta area, um, everything's clean and washed and everything like that. But I need to get rid of them. <laughs> yes, it's just getting to be too much. So now we have to re we have to start over with everything because it's a boy. And just with how like Corona is going on, like I don't know, like baby shower wise and all of that type of stuff, what we will do. So we're just like, we'll just get what we probably just get what we probably need and ask people for Pampers, but we'll see. So we got, already got a few things. <laughs> Let me. It, what kind of? You know, I don't like polyester. It's, what's the? Is it polyester? The microfiber, because Kenzie and Ami they break out with this type of texture with their eczema. So I gotta be like super careful. I'm gonna treat him just like I treat the girls. Like he would have eczema, even though I don't necessarily think Ami has it, but Kenzie does. So it's like certain materials that I just don't like putting on their skin, and you know, making sure to wash their stuff. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're fine. Girl. Yeah. Where is Ami? Y'all, it is so hard to show up with two people that can run. What are you doing? What are you doing, Ami? Yes, I'm free. <laughs> I'm free, free at last. And then get some like sizes that are like bigger sizes. Like may even one year old or like 10, 12 months. Kenzie, Kenzie, be careful. Be careful. <sighs> God, they're just so happy to be outside. They're just, they're just so happy to be outside. Okay. All right, so we just got from the mall. Um, these girls are, it's, it's kind of blurry, but it started raining like, and it's still raining. So it was, the, the mall was just too packed. It was too packed. And like most of the stores had lines, so we only went to Macy's. But yeah. we did get some um, some stuff from Macy's for our little. Let me see if I can put y'all right here. Yeah. Get what? What? What's wrong? You should drop something. What you want? Your mask? Your mask is is between your legs. Yeah, there, there you go. <laughs> this was Mackenzie's first time wearing a mask and now she don't want to take it off. So, let me show you a few things that we got. <sighs> yeah, I think it's, yeah, I think it's like the right, yeah, to get on 285. Okay, so, got him So we, oh, we just got a whole bunch of these because you mamas out there, y'all know that Especially the first few months where they're not going outside, they're probably they're most most of the time they just living in these. And I actually this is the second one, but I have this is what Sar picked out, but I had it in like three months. So little brother. Oh. And just like some little outfits. Um, because they were having a 50% sale. Some little outfits. Yeah, they were having a 50% sale, so it's pretty dope. And then I got me some stuff that I need because my body is changing <laughs> with this pregnancy. Um, and we were talking about uh, what if the gender is wrong. Like, I've heard like different, I ain't gonna say horror stories, but different interesting stories about like the baby come out and it's a completely different gender. But thankfully, 
like thankfully first of all we haven't had our 20 week anatomy scan yet so when we get there to confirm the gender because we went to a or i went to a boutique uh ultrasound to find out the gender to surprise them for father's day and i went on google to like look at what little boys you know stuff look like down there genitalia wise um for the amount of about for 16 weeks to see like okay does this look the same or is she wrong and i compared the ultrasound features i was like okay no i think it's a little boy but we were like yo if we got it we came and they were like actually it's a girl yeah i'm sorry everybody so I, <laughs> i'm pretty sure there was some type of clause in the document that i signed that will prevent us from being able to do that yeah, that's crazy yeah <laughs> i can even imagine you know, right now my deepest prayer is going that her uh Revelation be true. Because <laughs> if not, Lord knows I'll be wrong. <laughs> yeah. I think it's right though. I looked at his ultrasound picture. Um, and I'm like, it's a boy. But you know, you're always in the back of your mind like, what if they wrong? But like, I don't think they wrong. It's, it's a boy because even when she was going over, um, let me give you a little back history. First of all, she, uh, I went to the ultrasound tech and it's called they're called Hey Baby, they're in Atlanta. And I went there with Ami too, but I went back, I went there and um, she was like, you know, what do you want? And I was like, you know, we would like a little boy, um, but we have two girls. So it could probably most likely be another little girl. And she was like, okay. And she's like, you know, I got four boys. And you know, my husband wants me to try for another one and I don't know, but blah, blah, blah. So as she's going over the ultrasound picture, I mean the ultrasound like over my belly, I thought I saw something, right? But then she kept saying, oh, look at the umbilical cord is between the baby's legs and the uh, placenta. And when I was like, the placenta between his, like between the baby legs, like they don't sound, they don't make sense. But she kept like going by it. And then she was like, okay, I know what it is. And I'm like, how do you know what it is? Cause to me, she's just talking about how, she, how like the baby legs was closed and everything. And, but now that I look back at it, I can tell she was trying to like, confuse me so then I closed she said close your eyes and I'm gonna either give you a pink bear or a blue bear and so I closed my eyes y'all I, I ain't never feel as much anxiety in my life I opened my eyes y'all she gave me the pink bear and I'm not even gonna lie y'all my heart dropped I was like oh it's another girl and she was like read oh we don't even have it in here she was like read the button on the bear and the button on the bear said it's a little boy and y'all i jumped up off that table mess flew off i was like what she was like yeah she was like trust me i have four little boys i know i know one when i see one and so then she told me to lay back down she was like let me show you and let me show you the pictures that i took um to confirm and she showed me and i was like oh my god something is there because you know, with the girls' ultrasounds, they were ain't nothing there. That's how I knew even Ami was a girl. I'm like, I ain't even got a question because there's nothing there. And hold on, baby. And um, you want more? Okay. And um, she showed me the pictures that she were that she was. That where I put it in? Hold on. She showed me the pictures that she was taking. Um, while she was talking to me, trying to confuse me. Um, she asked, it was there, it was there. And I cried a little bit. I mean, I was just so excited. I was supposed to wait. Um, uh -oh. Mackenzie, seriously, man. Huh. Um, and so she was like, yeah, it's a boy. And so she gave me like this little blue bear with his heart beating in it and the plan was, I don't even know if I told a sort of complete plan. The plan was we went to Savannah for Father's Day weekend because that's just SARS. That's that's his place. So we went to, the plan was I contacted um one of like our business partner, because we have a printing company. I contacted him the day before and I said, you know, if if I send you the gender, would you be able to make a shirt and then like I come get it the same day, like within a few hours? And he was like, Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So I contacted him because my appointment was like eight o'clock in the morning. I contacted him and um, I told him I was like, "So boy," so he was like, "All right, got you." You know, I have it done by one. So the plan was to get the shirts, wrap them up, and then wait to give it to him on that Sunday because we found I found out that Friday. <laughs> 
that was the plan to wrap it up and like maybe get a few little boy outfits and then give it to him Sunday on actual Father's Day. But y'all, she told me like right away. If anybody know me, I can't hold water unless I absolutely, unless I have to, like, unless it's like, look, still can't. Unless it's like, nah, I, I, can't, I can't hold water, especially when he was excited. He was excited to knew he was gonna be so freaking excited. And again, he did not know I was even going. So, yeah, he didn't even know I was going. So, when I got back to the house, I was supposed to be going to get a car looked at. And I came back in there because she gave me like a little brown bag and I gave it to him. And um, he pulled out the blue bear and he was like, the blue bear? And then he was like, it's a, it's a boy? And I was like, yes. And he's like, hold up. Oh, my legs. I wish I could wait. Should I wait? It's up to you, boo. I can't wait. What's this? Blue bear. It's a boy? Hey, <laughs> yes, Lord. <laughs> Father, our prayers have been answered. <laughs> ah, Simon McQuaid Jr. is here. <laughs> yes, yes. Where you find out? Just now. I didn't get the transition there. I'm going to go get it done now. But. Trifling. Mm -mm -mm. All right, boo. Only two more kids after this. No, we're done. <laughs> we're done. <laughs> yes, indeedy. See his little pee wee. Mm mm mm. Oh, that man big. Shut <laughs> Stupid. Lord, we thank you, Jesus. It's a boy. Yes, it is indeed. Woo. Terry get her wish. I get mine. <laughs> Father, we thank you. Yep, I'm done having babies. Mm -hmm. He got his son. Yes, yes, yes. You can indeed. his heartbeat is in there. Oh, snap. Where you get this from? Um, the ultrasound place I went to. Oh, okay. 